All right, guys, I'm here today to try this uh, Brush Hero. Been seeing a lot of stuff online about these things for washing mountain bikes, cleaning your car wheels, a little bit of everything it looks like. So they've been sounding pretty good. So I'm gonna give it a shot on my uh, on my mountain bike today. There it is, just goes on to the end of a hose like a normal attachment. Interchangeable brushes on the end, I think. Yeah, it comes with another one in here. I think the other one's a stiffer bristle maybe. Yeah, a little bit stiffer bristle. I don't know. I'll either try the black one first. A little instruction paper here, how it works. It all comes apart. It looks like it's all pretty much rebuildable, it looks like, if something would go wrong. So, different languages. So, yeah, there it is. We'll, uh, we'll give it a shot. <clears throat> I'm going to show you guys my normal, normal bike washing routine. Start with this... Uh, Slick off-road wash here. You know, I usually put it into a spray bottle here, but I'm just about out of water. I got a little bit in here, but... Not real close to the hose right now, so... I got a partial bottle of water here. Nothing but the best pure filtered water for my bike, right? Fill that right on up to the top there. <clears throat> now this stuff says it's supposed to be a certain amount. I forget what it is. 32 to 1 dilution ratio. So that looks to me like about, oh, one. Yeah, about that much. That'll work. Felt like a 32 to 1 squeeze. Give it a good shake. And uh, there we go. Usually what I do is I spray that on the bike first, let it soak for a little bit, and then uh, we're gonna give this brush hero a try, see what it does. So first impressions of the Brush Hero, this little guy right here, I like it. Makes cleaning it pretty easy. Just spray it down, let it soak for a minute or two, and then just hit it with a Brush Hero. And then usually what I do after it's all said and done is go down through and get uh, with the air compressor and blow it off. But I mean, in the tight spaces where a normal brush don't necessarily get, it got in there pretty good. Um, I'm pretty happy with it. So for, I got this on sale at Walmart for 20 bucks. So go grab one. I think you might be happy with it.